Hey everyone, it's Genchizi here today, and before I start my play review guys, I just want to tell you to go check out uh, below in the description uh, FIFA Coin Traders and give a click so maybe I can earn some coins, you know, for my channel. Thank you guys. So yeah guys, as you guys can see today, I'm going to be doing a review on Gonzalo Castro. He uh, cost me 70k. He has 4 star weak foot, 3 star skill moves, and I'm playing him in the camp formation in my Bundesliga squad. As you guys can see right now on the screen are his in-game stats and the highlight of this player for passing and his shot power. As you guys can see his short passing is 90 and um, if you guys purchase this guy you guys will see that short passing the curls like Xavi, Iniesta you know when they hit that ball that outside curve on it that inside curve and it goes right along the line yeah you guys will get that. But uh, his shot power, guys, I wouldn't say it's the best. I know it says 87, but um, to tell you the truth, guys, it's more like 80. It's not all the way up there, 87. I don't know. Maybe not for me. You guys could try him out. Maybe leave a comment down below and tell me what you guys think. But yeah, guys, to, to start the review, this guy, he has a good finishing. He has a decent shot power, like I mentioned earlier. It's not amazing, but it's it's there it's all right yeah um he has decent headering but that's when he gets to the header he usually is not there for the headering due to his medium medium work rates i wouldn't say medium medium work rates is bad but uh yeah his also that's something else his work rates are good uh for his position he's center attacking mid he drops back a bit and goes up a bit so yeah guys he he, what can I say, his work rates are good, and as you guys saw, I just put that clip in uh, to show you guys that, like, not only does he score only on his own, but he also gets his teammates, uh, like, a chance to score, you know, he shot the ball, he missed, and the player put it in, so yeah, he opens those opportunities too, and yeah, guys, he has a decent dribbling, as you guys will see right now, I know you guys are probably thinking, wow, he has crazy dribbling right there, as you guys saw, but nah, it's not crazy, it's all right. He has um, amazing passing, uh, uh, which I mentioned earlier. And the only thing I didn't really like about this guy was that he didn't really feel like that 81 pace, like I was saying earlier. He has that 81 pace. He didn't really feel like it. Maybe it was something like 78, 79, maybe even lower. I don't know, guys. I don't really feel... And, uh, yeah, I wouldn't say he's really worth his price, guys. I don't think you should go spend it, but if you want, you can. And, uh, yeah, also, the only final thing that I really didn't like was that he was weak. He'd get pushed off the ball really easily. And, uh, yeah, that was something I didn't like. But other than that, yeah. So here, guys, are his pros and cons. His pros are he has good finishing, decent shot power, decent headering, amazing passing, decent dribbling. His work rates are good for his position. His cons are that he's really weak, and as I said, not 81 pace. Doesn't even feel like it. His height, he didn't. I didn't really like him, and he wasn't really worth his price tag. So today, guys, the final rating I gave this player was a 7.5 out of 10. And yeah, I didn't really like him, but uh, I guess he was in the middle there. And yeah, guys, can you uh, please drop a like? That would be really appreciated. And yeah, uh, I want to see you guys back, you know. <laughs> so yeah, guys, here are my uh, Twitter and my Twitch. You can also click those links down below in the description. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And you guys can click on DeVeo and... Um, that was my previous video, so you guys can go there and uh, check it out. Just click on them and uh, you'll be there. And yeah, guys, so that's it. And I better see you back or else I'll do nothing.